I remember Alvin telling Tiny McFarlane, I can't break in a new drummer. We're opening for a guy named Bruce Silverstein. He's supposed to be some sort of real hot dog out in New York. Bruce Springsteen played the Armadillo World Headquarters when only a few people knew about him, but they were finding out so fast that between the time tickets went on sale and the time we sold out, wasn't but a couple of days. Alvin put on a great show, and Bruce Springsteen was just nervous as he could be. Walked back and forth, and Mr. Threadgill looked down and saw him, said to Tiny, that old boy is nervous as a coon dog trying to pass a peach pit. Well, some of the girls that had found out about Bruce brought in a rosy t-shirt, a beautiful, sexy, airbrushed shirt. Bruce put on the shirt, put his jacket back on. Burton took a couple of snapshots of it. Then he went out and did a huge, hard, sweaty set. And the shirt, which was not color fast, completely melted away and dripped right on down into his jeans. Burton hadn't been there to take those pictures. There'd be no proof that that shirt ever existed. Oh.